federating the topology and the schematic model in a project setup. Let's start creating the file that will hold those two models. We need to attach the rail geometry as a reference file. And having the rail geometry attached as a reference file, we can create the topology model. It's fairly easy. Just select one of the alignments and accept, and that will create the topology model. Now we can generate the schematic model. And we can manipulate the layout of the schematic model. Like in this case here, when we are flipping the two siding tracks. We're not just flipping the graphics, but also the identity of the two siding tracks. With the manipulator point, we can fine-tune the layout of the schematic model. So it will suit our, our standard. With the schematic model and the topology model created, we can now move on and create the, the design file. And here we need both of those files attached as references. The railiometry and the topology and the schematic. We'll do the same thing here. We will open the schematic model, but in this case it will be a read-only reference.